There you go, that was Yusundur and uh, Dido, sounded lovely. Went on a bit at the end, I felt, but, but lovely, all the same, wonderful voices. Uh, I'm here with David Williams and Matt Lucas, of course, who were on stage a little while ago. Who did you introduce out there again? Uh, Sir Elton John. Sir Elton John, of course, who I'm sure uh, is familiar with your work. And I'll say well, he was in our um, comic relief special. Yeah. Oh, of course he was, yeah, yeah. Um, how are you finding the day? Are you enjoying it? Does it feel as kind of momentous, as, as kind of, you know, history-making as, as we're told it is, or...? I, I think it, yeah, I think it is. I mean, this is on an even bigger scale than Live Aid, isn't it? Yeah. With so many more concerts around the world. Although it's weird, I can't factor in that, that there's that many people there. I mean, if you ask me, I would say 10,000. I have no way of knowing, but that's, uh, that's almost 200,000 people out there, wow. people, or slightly more. It's crazy, yeah. It's amazing backstage, because as soon as we walked in, we saw Paul McCartney, and we had a picture with Paul McCartney, and then we saw like U2, then we saw Coldplay, then we saw Elton John, and I thought, you much. don't get these people together. And Bill and Gates, were you excited about seeing well, him? Well, he stormed in. We were. We did say hello, Bill, as we were coming yeah, in the car. He gave I mean, us a smile. Me, he was the highlight. Yeah. Also, I thought the way he whipped the crowd and the friends. <laughs> I know. Was, I mean, yeah. he just got <laughs> charisma. He's just got it, you know. All that money still can't buy a decent haircut, right? Um, <laughs> but he, he might be coming in a minute and tell us why Windows keeps crashing. Um, now, you, uh, you went to Africa for Comic Relief, didn't you? Okay, yeah. So presumably that's one of the reasons why you're involved here today. Yeah, definitely. I mean... Um, uh, when we put together the Little Britain Comic Relief Special, um, we were invited to go out and see the work that Comic Relief do in Ethiopia, we went to Addis Ababa, just so that when we, we, we talked about it, we actually knew what we were talking about, and it is absolutely shocking. You can't begin to explain quite how upsetting that is. You see, you, you haven't been there, you, you have a better idea. We, we hear these statistics, you see the, uh, the, the media reports here, we see the advertising campaign. I mean, the fact that one, uh, I think one child dies every three seconds. Uh, in Africa, so as we're speaking now, children are dying. It's it's almost incomprehensible. Yeah, it, it is. So, uh, and when you go over there, it's very distressing, but it is also uplifting. There is hope there, and uh, things like this today will bring more hope. You know. Yeah, um, I mean, I think that what's great is this has put Africa on you know the top of everyone's agenda. I thought I mean, you say on the map for a minute there. And I was like, well, <laughs> it's always been there. It's the brand new continent. Yeah, um, uh, I'm delighted to say. Uh, well, it, it's it, very impressive. I think the 1.5 million people have now signed up to the Live Eight list. That's a very. It's it's quite a, an incredible figure when you think about that in this country here. Yeah, 1.5 million people have already. Uh, uh, logged on. I'm sure they'll continue to do so during the day. Um, we're going to have a look now. Uh, of course, during the, the day so far, there have been concerts going on around the world. Some started around the same time as us. Some are going before. Some are yet to start. But we now have a package of some of the highlights from some of the other concerts that have been going on today around the world.